23-year-old Ryan Passat appeared before Magistrate Marissa Mittelhalzer at the Georgian Magistrate Court, charged with driving under the influence of alcohol. Passat, who is attached to the police impact base at the Brigdown Police Station, pleaded not guilty to the charge. It is alleged that on September 1st, he drove Guyana Police Force minibus PVV4652 while his breath alcohol level was 91 micrograms. The legal limit for alcohol consumption while driving is 35 micrograms. The Gordon Street Kitty Georgetown resident was represented by attorney at law Isu Anderson, who made an application for bail on the grounds that his client is the sole breadwinner for his family. Police prosecutor Cheryl Lane made no objection to bail, but noted that the accused is currently being investigated in another matter, which stemmed from the same incident. Passad was released on $25,000 bail and the matter is adjourned until October 11th. He was also ordered to lodge his passport at the court. The cop was not charged with causing death by dangerous driving, as is customary in cases like these. However, Newsroom understands that the police are awaiting legal advice as to whether the constable should be charged with this offense. Akeem Anthony was killed when the cops struck him off his motorcycle at around 23 hours 40 in the vicinity of Back Circle, East Rheinveld, Georgetown. According to the police, the policeman was proceeding east along the northern carriageway of Mandela Avenue, while Anthony was riding in the opposite direction on motorcycle CJ511. Police headquarters revealed that Anthony turned north into the path of the minibus in an attempt to cross into Back Circle Street, but because of the short distance, the bus collided with the motorcyclist. As a result of the impact, Anthony fell onto the roadway and sustained injuries about his body. He was rushed to the Georgian Public Hospital in an unconscious state where he died while receiving medical attention. Reporting for the newsroom, Fariza Hanif.